Hi guys, uh, let me demonstrate uh, the MQTT protocol, how the data can be transferred using MQTT protocol using uh, SIMCOM's A7600C1 module. So I have uh, SIMCOM's A7600C1 module with me. I have just connected it using the USB cable and uh, make sure the SIM, SIM card is inserted with the network registered and also make sure the antenna is connected in appropriate uh, point. So I just connected the SIMCOM module using a, a USB cable and uh, it will ask for the drivers. I have just installed the drivers in the link provided in the description of this video. Now, uh, let me just run the code line by line and uh, the AT commands line by line and then show you the how we can connect to the MQTT server or MQTT broker. <coughs> so in my case, I'm connecting my uh, Simco module to mosquito.org uh, broker. So for that, actually, we need to download and install the mosquito.org broker. So let me open my command prompt. Let me locate the mosquito installation folder. CD space dot org, CD space dot org, CD space program files, mosquito. So my mosquito software is installed in uh, program files mosquito folder. Now let me type the commands. <coughs> so the command for subscribing into a topic is uh, mosquito underscore sub space minus h space this is your uh, uh, host address test dot mosquito dot org and port number 1883 the default port number for MQTT protocol connection is uh, 1883 and then space and uh, minus t is nothing but the topic name so let me give the topic name as iota and hyphen d d indicates a debug so it will uh, let you know the status of the connection if there is some error in the connection then it will return the error if you just type it hyphen d at the end of the command so press enter yeah so this command prompt is now uh, a subscriber to the topic iota now let me run these commands one by one in my terra term let me open terra term just configure the terra term serial port so after installing the drivers and connecting the gsm module to the laptop or computer it will show the list of uh, com ports and you need to select this com port I have installed the drivers from Syntec. So as provided in the link given in the description. So now we need to select this COM port to which I can send the AT commands. Okay. And set up the baud rate. The baud rate should be Eleven five two double zero. Yeah. 
now you can test the connection using at command so the response came as ok now you can just uh, copy these commands one by one paste it in teratom enter so at cgd co nt command is used for uh, creating the pdp context next command is at and cmqtt start remember this these commands are suitable for simcom a 7600c1 module so the mqtt connection is established and uh, mqtt acquire client command will acquire the client with the client id client 1 i have given client id as client 1 okay now at cmqtt connect so this will actually uh, connect the client to the mqtt broker yes you should observe this uh, response from the module otherwise you can see uh, if 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 the response is not C plus cmqtt colon 0 comma 0 if it is something else then the number at this position the number at highlighted position uh, will actually give the error code so you can see the documentation of this income module for the error code and then you can take necessary action now let me give the topic name so it will prompt for the topic name once you enter this uh, command atcmqtt topic the second parameter is the length of the topic name so four characters so i have given four first parameter is the uh, context index tcp context index and then the next command is cmqtt payload so the second parameter in the payload is the number of characters in the text you want to transfer and uh, so i'm going to transfer this text hi morally So it's actually 11 character uh, string. I'm, but I'm transmitting. Uh, sorry, it's a it's a 11 character string, but I'm giving the, the second parameter as uh, 10 only. So let us see what happens. So let's open the um, Let's open the command prompt. So you can observe that uh, the subscriber is uh, waiting for uh, receiving the messages. Now I'm going to type the next command. AT plus CMQTT pub equal to 0 comma 1 comma 16. This actually perform the publishing of messages. I'm sorry. Yeah, this will perform publishing of messages. So you can observe when I I press the enter in uh, enter for this command, the message will appear in the command prompt here. So please notice that. Yes. So we can see in the command prompt the message has appeared. Hi Morley dot. I have kept two dots in the string I have transferred, but I received only one dot. That's because uh, the number of characters, the payload parameter. Okay. 
so in order to translate 11 characters i need to put the parameter as 11 instead of 10 okay after publishing the message you just need to disconnect you need to disconnect from the broker and uh, release the connection and uh, stop the mqtt stop the mqtt done so if you want to transmit uh, another message you just need to start from here again you need to establish the connection mqtt connection to the broker sorry uh, we sorry we already stopped the connection so we need to start from atmqtt catc mqtt start command because we already entered the cmqtt stop also right so now the mqtt connection started client one acquired connected to the broker topic name AOT payload enter some text hello So let us see actually uh, we need to type the carriage return and uh, carriage return also but uh, let us see what happens now this time yes so the message got uh, clipped so let me let me send one more time now i'm not uh, disconnecting so I just need to disconnect the message. So disconnect the connection with broker in order to send the string again. Let us try connecting once again. For the same client so there is some error code appearing here that's because uh, i have not terminated the connection properly so let me terminate the connection properly yes now it is terminated properly now i can connect again yes now it is connected topic name i o t e payload let me copy this as it is done publish let us open the command prompt also yes now it is published again you can see it here all right so let me disconnect now okay it got pasted double twice so yeah. 
copy paste okay. done so the connection got disconnected so thanks for listening the required uh, details are provided in the description uh, you can uh, check the details thank you have a nice day